Hello everyone, and welcome back to some more Dragon Quest Monsters. Speaking of monsters, we got so many new ones last time, didn't we? So, as I've said, we're gonna have a look and see if we can make any new ones. I'm guessing we probably will. Whether or not they're gonna be ones that we want, or are gonna use, that's a different story. But, let's have a look. Uh, and I think today, as well as hopefully, you know, going and checking out another Circle of Nadiria, I think we are gonna give the Rank C, uh fights ago. Ooh! Fire and ice! Very, very nice. Now, I don't know... Well, let's have a look. Also, we've got rat attack. Um, it's only rank E, but still. Uh, obviously the Cyclops as well, which we could make ages ago. Uh, but there's probably a bunch of new ones here as well. Look at this thing, the blue moon! Oh boy! Freaking armored scorpion! Bongo Fandango! Flying saucers, swinger! <laughs> oh my god! Um, and of course, the Dark sl uh, King Slime, which I'm really tempted to uh, try and do. Let's have a look. Oh, okay. Frolica and a rock bomb. That's actually very tempting. Very tempting. What about the fire one? Oh, we could use JG. Ooh, or we could not do. Um, looks like, yeah, the rock bomb is uh, integral to both of these. I reckon we'll probably go with... Oh, even Shenron. Even Shenron. Or the Ethereal Serpent. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Hmm, in attempts Blazer. I think we'll go with... Uh, we'll go with Gas Baggon and a rock bomb for this one. We're gonna do it. Uh, let me quickly check Gasbagon's talent points. Oh, you come with Blazer anyway. Um, not that that matters, because I haven't put any points into it, and we can't max it out anyway, because we've only got 70. Uh, Rock Bomb, same same deal. Uh, but we will be able to max out a skill tree, I'm guessing. Let's have a look. Yeah, we'll go with Blazer again. Uh, probably... Probably defense and attack. I don't know. Not fancy and martyr. No thank you. No self-destructing for me. Synthesis. So at least we, we're going to get a new monster today. That's good. I, uh... I don't know if we're going to use that one. We did get... Fuego, didn't we, last time? An NPC uh, that actually joined us and we can actually use him, so... I do wonder if we want to pop him on the team, actually. Magmalis, uh, will probably, actually, I think I might have a name for you. I'm guessing, yeah, you're going to be a, a magic spellcaster, although you don't look like a spellcaster, actually. You just look like a really angry bit of rock, so we're just going to leave you as that. I mean, Magmalis is a great, great name. Um, you are rank D, okay, and you're going to go, uh... Hmm, you know, for now, just so I can maybe level a few more monsters a bit quicker, I might pop our large ethereal serpent on the... on the reserves. I don't know. I might do it. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Confirm. Da 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 Let's have a look at this, uh, rat attack. Or rat -at -at attack I have no idea how many A's and T's are in the name. But um bum Let's have a look at you, Godvark and Achungus. Uh, I said that like that's the name of the monster. No, I just called it Chungus. Yeah, you know what? We'll go for that as well, shall we? We'll go for that as well. Uh, Prankster. Da 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 Go with Poison Preventer. And I don't really know. I'm not going to use this thing, so I'll just go for Bang Ward. That's fine. Do 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 do. But yeah, they totally look like kangaroos, don't they? They really do. Yay! <laughs> I love those mouse flaps. Right, you're going to stay as you are. I'm, I'm really tempted to make this Cyclops, because I don't think I'm ever going to get lucky enough to bloody scout the large one. I've, I've tried it so many times now, it's ridiculous. Um, so I might actually just go ahead and make it. Even though we're going to lose Moonshade if we do, uh, and Thor, but you know what? Cyclops is a new monster, so we're going to freaking do it. 
And Hulk. Helm Splitter. Okay, Stomp. Yep, that sounds about right. Power Player. Well, that can... Oh, I'd already learned. No, I don't want to double up. I don't want to double up. We're just going to go for Defense. And... Uh, Stun Stopper. Gonna get our, our one-eyed... Well, we've already had several one-eyed friends at this point. One of them's right there. So farewell, Moonshade and Thor. Hello, Cyclops. And I'm pretty sure someone has requested this, so let's check my list. Did a D. Bab. Ah, this is gonna be called Zorro. Uh, there we go. You know, how many how many times I've watched the uh, Antonio Banderas Zorro film. You know, the one with Catherine Zeta Zorro. Well, they, they did a sequel. They did a sequel. I didn't watch the sequel. But the first one, Mask of Zorro. Absolute banging film. Uh, so, oh, you know what? No, 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 no. We need, we need a capital... A capital Z. I was obsessed with Zorro growing up. Basically, because it, it is... It was an inspiration for Batman, wasn't it? Um, I love me some, some masked vigil vigilantes that maybe go a little bit too far sometimes. And maybe are a little bit violent. Zorro. Okay, and... Uh, yeah, I'm going to pop you... On the... Well, actually, no. You're, you're just going back to the paddock. That's fine. Dee -dee, doo -bee -dee -doo. Right, are there any more monsters we wanna we wanna make? Uh what was the dark slime again? I mean obviously Batman and Hypothermian. Uh, now you see, Hypothermian uh, we haven't used yet. I just like his design. Obviously Batman has been well, a previous MVP, no longer the case, but has been a very good member of the team. Uh, I mean, really, actually, we don't need to use Batman to make it. We could just use a Wing Slime and Hypothermian, but, uh... Oh, that's a point. Oh, that is a point. Heck, we could even use Barney. Or Rose. Um... Or a Slime Knight. I didn't realize we could use... Oh, oh that's really tempting, then. A Dark King Slime. I mean, am I really going to use hypotherm uh, Hypothermian? I think the Axorus probably has more chance of being used. Uh, even though this thing does have a pretty good skill tree. In fact, I think we maxed out his... Oh! That's one thing I should have done! <gasps> uh, I should have just made sure I maxed out some talent trees. Let's quickly spend some points. I know this is such a dull opening to a video, but let's do it. Uh... Yeah, Hypothermian. I'm pretty sure, yes, I can max out the Evil Genius skill tree, so let's do that. There we go. So maybe we'll get an even better one now. Uh, Axorus, 40 points. You've already maxed out your Spicy Slasher. Let's get you some attack. Very nice. Rat Attack and Mag Malice, I'm not too bothered about at the moment. But we might as well just throw them all into... Uh, well... Yeah, we'll throw them all into Blaze or whatever. Da da da, and Rat Attack, Prankster. Don't really care. Uh, Tentacle, you. Get okay, a bit more. Oh, not quite, not quite enough. What does Ultra Spellbinder do again? Oh, great, the res increases resistance to anti magic. Well, that would be very nice to have. Mr. Pig! Uh, no new stats for any of you guys. That makes me sad. Batman! None for you either. Okay! Um, right, that's pretty much all of us. Well, might as well spend... Spend the... Well, does it really matter? No, probably not. Uh, okay, right, let's try again. So, do I want to make this Dark King slime? And do I want to use up Batman to make it? This is the thing. Uh, I just don't know. I don't know, because... If we don't use Batman up, we can still keep Batman in the team for now, while we train up the Dark King Slime elsewhere. Um, also, this Tyranniceratops. Oh, yeah, Fuego. I bet a lot of these monsters use Fuego, don't they? Oh, maybe not. Yeah, they do. Okay. Mm. But Fuego's a rank C. I think we might actually try Fuego on the team, you know. We really might do. But, I think I'm going to do it. Just just for the sake of more monsters, we're going to do this. And we're going to use up 
Uh, we're gonna use a slime. Mm, maybe not a slime knight. We'll go with Rose and Hypothermian. We're gonna do it. And we're gonna take the evil genius. Uh, we could take Cupid, but nah, he's not. He's not gonna be a healer. We'll go with. Uh, Sleep, more HP and agility. And, uh, ah, definitely wisdom. Yeah, we'll go with Sis Ward and we'll go with Sleep Suppressor. I don't really know. That's not the best. Um, we can always resynthesize. It's fine. It's fine. Ba -ba -da -ba. Yeah, so bye bye, Hypothermian. We never got a chance to use you. You were pretty cool. But look at this Dark King slime. Oh my lord. Oh, right. Um, well, we're not going to name you anything just yet. Although, actually... You know what? No, we are going to name you. We are going to name you. You are going to be called... Hollow. Not Hulu. <laughs> Hulu. Hollow. There we go. There you go. Yay. Right. I said there you go a lot. Uh, continue synthing. Uh, maybe... I don't know if there's much else we want to get at this point, though. No, we've got a lot already. We have done a lot, and we have some monsters that we can level up now. I am tempted by the Great Saber Cat, though, I must admit. Mmm, Jax and the Axorus. Uh, I think the Axorus might be cool to use, though. But then again, it's a saber cat. It's a goddamn saber cat. Oh. Oh. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. He's a maniac. Frenzy. Uh, do I want... Oh, we can get multi-fists and multi-victimizer on you with that. That's pretty good. Uh, attack booster, yes. And... I guess more HP and defense? Paral par paralysis protector? Yeah. We're getting a great saber cat, guys. And uh, typically I would call this Bormran. Um, but someone has requested this, and it's going to be Felix, which is also a great name. Da, da, da. Dragon Quest 8, anyone? So this is going to be Felix. Da, 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 da. And uh, I hope you turn out to be quite the uh, quite the fearsome attacker. That'd be great. Right, I need to decide who's going to be on my bench for a while now, because we have uh, got quite a few choices. That was a lot of synthing. Diddy. But my main team is still intact. My main team is still intact. Uh, we're going to definitely keep Hollow, Felix. I think I'll swap out Rat Attack. I'm probably not going to use that. Uh, for... Yeah, Fuego. Hmm. Fuego. Do need to have a look at you. Yeah, I mean, stats... you got quite a bit of wisdom, actually, but you are level 30. Um, so, let's just have a see, because he, he might... He might make it onto the team. He might be good. Uh, does he have any talent points? He should bloody have talent points. He has 70, okay. Firebrand. He can learn Scorch as well. Umful. Kafriz. And Helia... Hel Heliotosis. What the heck does that do? What the heck does that do? Inflicts outrageous fire ele elemental breath damage on all enemies and occasionally stuns them for once. To oh, Fuego, you might end up being used, buddy. You might actually... Oh, boy. Yeah, that sounds pretty spiffy to me. Let's get those talent points spent. Da -da 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 -da. All 70 of them, so... We've already got up to Kafriz, that's pretty good. And I mean I might I might resynth him to get a a, a baby fuego and then 
get more talent points that way. Hollow, uh, we're gonna max out. Uh, do I want to max out the evil genius? Suppose we could do. Suppose we could do. But I might end up synthing this once it levels up a bit. Synthing it with Batman. Uh, yeah, I might do. I don't know. So we've nearly got that maxed out. Uh, okay. Felix. Yeah, Maniac. So we- oh, we've got Parallax as well, Multi-Fists. Mmm, and Sword Dance, and Multi-Slash. This is looking pretty good, I'd say. Looking pretty good. Once we get a few levels for these chaps, that's- that, uh, that bench is gonna be pretty, pretty decent. Right. Let's- oh, no new chests. I'm always so sad when there's no new chests here. Oh, right. Where are we supposed to go? I think we were supposed to go back to Rose Hill for the story. Yeah, well, we are technically in Rose Hill Tower, but let's leave out to the village or probably teleport back to the village. No doubt there's going to be some story stuff. Yep. And then, uh, yeah, then I might, I might try one of the, one of the Coliseums. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. Oh, we got a great saber cat, Dark King Slime. Hmm. Right, let's see what's going on in Rose Hill. Dun, 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 da -da 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 oh, you know what? I'm really tempted, actually. Hmm. I mean, Batman, you have been very good. Maybe I should have sent you. Maybe I should have sent to you. Oh, I don't know. Fuego. I think you're you're gonna try going on the team for a little bit just to see how you do. I've decided. You you're replacing Batman for now. Yes. Yes. Confirm. Thank you. Right. Bum bum bum. Oh, I was up until bloody well, basically all night, last night. Waiting for a doctor to turn up to have a look at me, Grandma. Oh my gosh. Getting old isn't fun, chaps. My lord! Oh, allow me to report, my lord. We've finally done it! Finally! <laughs> okay. Finally done what? We finally found him! The chosen hero! Oh! Oh, really? Let's go murder him. I'm sure that will end well. <laughs> I think they're talking about the main character of Dragon Quest IV. This is the place, sire. The village where the chosen hero is hiding. Are we seriously? Oh wow, we've gone straight here. Oh, snappity snap. I didn't think we'd actually see them in this game, you know. But we're monsters. We can't just walk in looking like this. We've drawn their ire instantly. Ha! <laughs> well, I have just the spell for that. Oh, it will let us change our appearances. Check and mate. Morph, okay. Ah. <laughs> you can look as your heart desires. Now, join hands and make a circle. God, I'd love a spell like that in real life. Morph! <laughs> of all the... <laughs> Oh my god, of all the of all the things we could have turned into. Thank you, Dragon Quest. Ah, my mistake, my lord. <laughs> oh, sire, aren't you a sight for a sore eye? <laughs> oh, please, don't take 
me off the board? Give me one more chance. Uh, here we go. More. No, no, no. This is cool. This will work. This is fine. Oh. Wow, I'm tall. I'm really tall. Well, that's more like it, isn't it? Well, let's make our move. Okay. All right, Monty. <laughs> I've gone and got us lost. I don't remember the name of this village. What was it called? The travelers here. You must have had a long trip. Let me show you to the inn. That sounded a bit like Jasper from Dragon Quest XI, Forgive then. Me for not sweeping, but you can rest your feet and relax at least. Oh, that's totally him. That is totally him. Are you seriously gonna have a nap? You even free to get some shot eye. Shut eye. Night. Oh my god, so I'm gonna do all the work, am I? I thought so. Wow. Did not did not expect this. Good morning. Even with all these humans around, I slept like a log. Oh, I slept like a log. So how do we capture this chosen hero? <sighs> Wait, what's that commotion outside? I don't know. Let's have a look, shall we? <laughs> they finally found us. The monsters are coming. Uh oh. They'll be here any minute. Grab a weapon and get ready to fight. Um. You see, this is the. Th I wish, I wish, I, I should have just rewatched, as much as it would make me cringe, a couple of my Dragon Quest IV videos, because I don't remember what happens at the beginning. Monsters? I, I don't believe it! I don't believe it! There we go, that's a bit better. So, what's, what's going on here? Why, why are other monsters attacking it? Is it, is it others, is it, is my dad behind this? Oh, off the run. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's Dolph. Quick, everyone, hide! Who knows what'll happen if they find us here? I'm pretty sure we're just stood out in the open. That he's definitely seen us. I am the Man Slayer. We know the so-called hero is here. Um, excuse me, mate. That is not your name. Bring him to me now. Bring me Solo. Anyone who disobeys dies today. Oh, is that what he's called? Solo? Really? I I, I don't know. Because you can name you can name the main characters in Dragon Quest anything you want usually, so it doesn't really they don't really have a name. Well, I guess they have a canon name now, but uh Hmm, not too eager to give him up. He looks so cool. I love his hair. Take arms and fight, my people. We must prevail. Yeah. Ra. Okay, maybe I skipped the audio there, but um, that was a very quiet battle charge. Oh, it's all kicking off. We are just watching it all. <gasps> Manslayer, I'm right here. 
Wait, they've given him a voice? Look at this sharpening the swords. Stay back, sire! You'll be killed! Well, I mean... I'm pretty sure this guy will be okay. Lord Manslayer! I got him! The hero has been eliminated! I don't think so. Excellent! <laughs> You've done well. Rest assured that you'll be rewarded handsomely for this. You see, if I was him, I'd be a bit miffed that one of my cronies got the got the privilege of killing the chosen one. I'd want to do it myself. We're finished here. We leave now. All oh, the flowers. Dolph the Destroyer. I wonder why he was pretending to be you, sire. It's a very good question. I couldn't tell you his plan, but at least he had the good grace to off the chosen one for us. Hmm. What? The chosen one was a fake? Uh. The, 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 then what happened to the real one? Wait, I'm confused. He was a phony. A great big phony. I trust you're all in fine, Vettel. Uh-oh. Well, what? you have seen it now <gasps> yourself, have you not? The terrifying nature of humankind. Eamon, I remember you. For the sake of their precious comrades, they will sacrifice even their own lives. If those led by the Chosen One are ever allowed to unite, their strength could overwhelm even ours. Yeah, yeah. They don't, they don't call Dragon Quest IV chapters of the Chosen for nothing. Wait a minute, have we seen him in this game before? Because I do remember Eamon, but now I'm thinking, am I just remembering him from earlier in the game? I, it's been so long, I don't remember. <laughs> I don't know, anyway. Hmm, what indeed, what indeed. Would it be amusing to see Nadiria destroyed? I do feel like this would have, it would have benefited from having Sorrow be actually voiced. Because I'm not, I'm, you know, I've played Dragon Quest IV a long time ago. The details on that plot are very hazy to me. And the way that this is tying into it, I'm just, a, I'm a little bit confused on the, on what's actually going on. <laughs> and I feel like if he was voiced, it might be a bit, a bit, you know, I don't, I don't know. Anyway, well, doesn't I matter. Do. Yeah, he ain't dead. Huh? The man slayer. Dun dun dun. Okay, well that was that was a very unexpected little detour into Dragon Quest Four Land. Oh, okay. I mean, you're a, you're a grown woman. You can do what you want. What? You want to destroy all humankind? What are you talking about? I feel like we've made this known to you before. Wait. You're going to use the secret of evolution to gain the strength to do this, aren't you? Wait, please. See what I mean? Like it just falls a bit flat when when he doesn't talk. I I know that Dragon Quest is always a silent protagonist, a mute protagonist, but I feel like in this in this instance, because he is a villain, 
in, in another game. I just think it would have worked better. Maybe had a bit more impact. Yeah, I, I, I like that they are connecting it to one of the, you know, one of the main games. Uh, but I really, I don't need all this story. I think the game is fun enough on its own without it. And I just think they probably could have done it a little bit better. Although, if you are a huge fan of Dragon Quest IV, you probably are enjoying a lot of these references. I'm just so hazy. It's been so long since I played it. Ah, uh, right. Well, anyway, that was a hefty bit of story. Let's, uh... Go to... Well, I think we. Mm, I did. I did say. Can I? Can I go? Wait. Why can't I? Do I have to go to another circle in the deer? It looks like I have to. I can't go to anywhere else on Terrestria right now, which is weird. Okay then. Well, I think it's probably gonna be one of these two. Oh no! Actually, yeah, we've already done. We've already done that one. We've already done that one. Um, Circle of Caprice or Indulgence? I fancy I oh I fancy a bit of cake. Let's let's go back to the Circle of Indulgence. Maybe once we arrive here, we'll be able to go back and uh, do other things. Because what well, I need to go to the paddock actually and get my reward as well. Okay, can I go? Oh, there we go. Right, we're back. We're back. But first, let's actually just leave and see what the upper echelon of this looks like. Dun -dun. I mean, there's no way we're gonna do a, a repeat of last episode and, and go through it, it all and get the boss done today, but uh, we'll at least have a gander. But yeah, what, what are your thoughts on, on the story so far? Whoa! Oh my god, this looks even more incredible! Yeah, this is easily my favorite world. Easily my favorite area. Look at that high-def texture of that grass. <laughs> yeah, what, what are your thoughts on the story? Are you, and especially those who have played you know, Dragon Quest IV and, and understand these references. And and also those who haven't, because I I imagine most people who are playing this... I, I am... Sorry, Rose, I'm interrupting you here. I imagine most people who are playing this, because it's on the Switch, it's a new Dragon Quest game, and Dragon Quest IV, let's be honest, is really old and not exactly easy to play these days. I imagine most people playing this haven't played IV and are probably a little bit lost with the story and the way that it's been presented. Uh, I wonder what's happening. That's a big donut. That's a big donut, that, isn't it? Mmm, I'm so hungry now. Okay. Let's go and take a peek. Hopefully we can find out what's afoot. Or, or, a, or a, a hand. Yeah, I do, I do like the circle of indulgence. Look at all this. Oh, look at this chocolate bridge. Oh my god, my mouth is actually watering. Right, again, check behind the tower. There's not going to be anything here, though. Don't you worry. In fact, we can't even go behind the tower on this one. Fair enough. Uh, so there's some there's something going on over there at the big cake stand. And we've got more of these little things. And more corn! All enemies we've seen before. Uh, oh my god, it's another freaking Don, Don Mole. In fact, oh, several of them. I thought maybe that would be a large monster, but, uh... What, what do we have here? Oh, he is a large monster! Calypso King, but there was bloody two of them! And I, Oh, wait, we haven't actually scouted the co... Co... Coa... Blobolisk! 
Um, right, well, let's see how uh, uh, Fuego does in a fight. Buff yourself all you want. Oh, buffing him. Okay. Reflecting breath. Okay, not too scary. Of course, he's getting multiple turns because he's a big boy. Oh, shit. Oh, I just... <laughs> that was not good. Mr. Pig, please don't do that again. All right, you're down. Right, let's see if we can scout this guy. We've weakened him a little bit. Uh, scouts. Calypso King. Yeah, he's a tropical, uh, more- Oh, no, of course, he's large. We've done- Oh, 1.3%. Can you imagine? I know I've been really lucky in this playthrough so far, but can you imagine if I actually got him then? Part of me wouldn't be surprised. Oh, no, 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 no. Missed everyone? Good. Right. I'm really nervous that Mr. Pig is gonna- not know not to use breath, so we're going to just give orders here. Uh, fuego. <laughs> Inflicts medium fire elemental slashing damage on all enemies. Or major fire element. Yeah, we'll do like a frizz. Single targeting. Very nice. Mr. Pig. Uh, yeah, you can't really do much right now. Just attack. And tend to kill. I think we would like a multi heal, please. We're, uh, probably not going to manage to scout this guy anytime soon. Oh, <laughs> zero damage. I mean, he is buffed, though, so... But, uh, tell you what, Kafriz ain't too shabby. He's so, he's so rotund. How... How much health did you have left, buddy? Uh, oh, I'm going to risk it. More heal yourself. Very wise. Oh, he's doing the breath again, for fuck's sake. Oh, but no! Okay, it was only the one time. Okay, phew. I thought maybe that was, like, a permanent thing it had. Thank God. Right, that was good. Okay. Very nice XP. Our bench... bench mons are nearly level 10 already. Wow, okay then, yeah, Calypso King's just walking around. Unless we got really lucky there, but definitely two of them spawned. Uh, I'm not seeing any more now. Did we just get really lucky with those? Surely not. Surely not. Right, well anyway, I think, um... Nah, nah, they turn up pretty regularly, looks like. Dancing... Performing for the corns. Um, oh, is that a joke, by the way? Sweet, sweet corn. Because, is that a joke? I don't know. Anyway, we're going to go, and we're going to go try, and just see how good we are compared to the rank C uh, Endor Coliseum fight. I have a feeling we might do okay, but it might just be a little bit much for us. But again, rank D was actually quite easy, so we'll give it a go. We'll give it a go. And then in the next video, we will explore more of that lovely place. Do you want to have a go? How much money is this going to be? A thousand? A thousand gold? That's alright, we got 21. It's fine. Well, it is going to be a bit painful if we do lose this. Alright. Come on, Mr. Pig. Come on, Mr. Pig. Hopefully JG can soak up some damage. Fuego. Set things on fire and tend to kill. Keep us alive. Entering the category C Mega Brawl is the young man who's got more wins under his belt than you've had hot dinners. His battle prowess is off the charts. Yes, it's the boy who would be king of the ring. 
The boy who would be king of the ring. Very nice. Look at my team. My team is amazing. And fighting him will be none other than Dancing Dolly. Careful or she'll waltz you right into the hospital. <laughs> okay. Oh, she's got a freaking crockabugle do. Now, on to the first match. Let's brawl. Bring it, Dolly. Dun, 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 dun. Right, so we got uh, some sort of cactus ball, Hooper Trooper, Rockin' Rock Hopper. Okay, so they're quite fast, which is worrying. Why would you do that? Why wouldn't you just heal? Boom. Ouch. Oh, yeah, this is. Oh, no. This is getting a bit spicy already. And now they're all freaking buffed. For the love of God. And evasion. And the reflecting spells. Oh, no. At least. Only one of them is reflecting the breath, but that still sucks. I hate that ability. And now Kafriz is going to bounce right back at us. No, it isn't. Wait, I'm confused. That only affects one of the monsters. Well, we got rid of one of them now. Okay. Um, oh, yeah, things are getting more interesting, aren't they? I really need that Omni Heal to come off. Tentacle, I know you've got it waiting in in the uh yeah there we go waiting in the wings <laughs> get it because it's, it's a wing slime or a flutter slime whatever right, please don't reflect back at me now nah, we're good we're good and we've prevented spells on the rockin rock hopper it's dead any wow that did so much damage fuego my dude Okay, this started off pretty worrying, but you know what? We've absolutely trounced this. Again, though, Mr. Pig and now having an even more pow uh, potent, like, um, single targeting attacker in Fuego. I think Batman might never make it, make it back onto the team, unfortunately. I think we probably are going to synth it with the uh, Dark King slime. And make an even more powerful one. All right, round one done without uh, too much bother there. Our king in waiting crushes the first round. A few more fights like that and he'll have to get himself fitted for a crown. Now facing him in the second round is Danny Deathmatch. Will <laughs> his hard-hitting magic spell the end for our hero? Oh, he's a, he's a magic uh, user, is he? Danny Deathmatch. Oh, that's quite a fearsome looking team. No time to waste. On with the second bout. Let's brawl! In fact, the monster on the far right looks very familiar. Was that not a boss in one of the later Dragon Quest games? It looks very similar, actually. A hyperbore <laughs> hyperborean. Warhog not so macho and ripped rabbit. Oh. I'm a little bit nervous about this one. Oh, going for a hustle dance. Okay. Interesting. It did the job. Sky Splitter. Ouch! Oh my god, Fuego, how are you still alive, dude? God, I honestly, Mr. Pig is frighteningly good. All right, one down. We really, 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 really need to heal fast. I think Fuego might bite the dust here. I'd be very surprised if he survives. But if he does die, we can Kazing him, so... Now oh, we got the more heal off. Fantastic. Beautiful. Oh, you've got Miraculous Touch as well. Uh, kabuff. Annoying, but don't think that's going to save you now, pal. 
cold breath is just too powerful. Yes. All right. Oh, wow. This is actually, I mean, they're hitting us pretty hard. They are hitting us pretty hard, but you know what? Our damage output is is doing is doing the business. What a scorcher! We have our winner. Our would-be king moves one step closer to the throne. I didn't use scorch though. I used cold breath, mate. You suck. He might look stony cool on the outside, but he's a deadly inferno inside. Like a volcano, he's about to explode. Master of ceremonies, you are not the master of of zingers. This is this is so lame. But standing in his way is the apex predator of category C, Peckish P. Uh <laughs> He'll take a chomp out of any would-be champ. Peckish Pete. I love how thick his mustache is. And how black it is. Oh, he's going with two large ones, is he? Oh, we got an old, uh, a freaking troll. The last match. Who will maul and who Whatever, I, I don't want to listen to you ever again. You suck. Team, team Aussie all the way. Uh, so we've got... That is, de that is an Argon Lizard right there. Um, great Argon Lizard and a boss troll. Ooh, shit. And this is just rank C as well. Right, missed me. Good, good first opening uh, gambit there. Very nice. Oh, didn't get the poison. That's okay. Don't kill Fuego. Oh, thank God, Hatchet Man missed. Oh, God, he, they, why are you getting so many turns? This is bullshit. Right, can we please do some damage here? That's alright. Nice. Oh, I was gonna say it'd be great if we could put you to sleep. Not quite so lucky. Uh, right, we really need to heal. Omni heal. Be oh, baby. I'm so glad we've got that. And we dodge! Oh, of course, we're immune to damage still. X- oh, bollocks. Did you seriously have to do- Oh, well, there goes our main attacker, but maybe Fuego can finish off one of them. Yes, he do- yes, he does. It's alright, we can kazing, we can kazing. It's fine. If we survive this, that is. Oh, no, that's okay. That's all right. There we go. I really wish that bring you, uh, brought you back with more health, but... Uh... Oh, not dead. Not quite. It's really annoying because JG, really, it, the only reason JG is in my team is to soak up damage and none of them ever fucking hit him. It's it's so frustrating. Uh, again, maybe our Omni Heal would have been better there, actually, but okay. That's it. Hit JG. Oh, he did poison me. You're still kicking. Ah, you won't be after this. You still are kicking after that! Yes! Sucks to be you, buddy! Sucks to be you. I think we've got this in the bag now. I mean, we had it in the bag before that, I reckon, but, uh... Ha ha ha! Finally! Good lord. Okay, I don't think there's much chance of us managing the rank B one, but... Rank C is done. Fuego has been a tremendous addition to the team. No one who can stand in his way. The winner of category C is the boy who would be king of the ring. Put those hands together and give him all the applause you've got. Yay! What's my reward gonna be? Gosh, you really come into your own when you're fighting, don't you? 
You positively sparkle. Here's oh, your thanks. reward for conquering category C. And thankfully, we didn't waste the thousand uh, gold. Sarah acquires a another metal slime card. Okay. Looks like you're a big crowd favorite these days. Don't forget, though, I was there before any of them. I'm still your first and biggest fan. Oh, I wish I knew your name. Good luck for the next one, handsome. Oh, thanks. All right. Now, do we do we go and try the rank C at the mausoleum? I think we have to. I think we have to. Um. I'm really- I really don't know who to use these Metal Slime cards on, though. I'm really not sure. We've got so many of them as well. And it's only a small amount of XP, actually, isn't it? Ugh. I actually thought they were better than that. Uh, right. We've not, uh... Not got too many more. Oh, we do have a few talent points to spend. Alright, let's max out Evil Genius again. Boom. And I think I'm gonna go with... Uh, Sis Ward. Bit more wisdom, I think, needed for you. Felix. Max out. Maniac. Okay. Magmalis. Nearly got Blazer maxed out. Okay, good, good, good. All talent points spent. Right. Let's go. Yeah, let's go to the mausoleum. Let's go to the mausoleum. Zoom. Yeah, the, the honestly, the monster fights, especially the Coliseum fights, are so fun. I this is this is the main reason I'm playing this game. Don't really care about the story, uh, but it's nice that it's there. It's just yeah, I'd I'd rather I'd much rather be doing this sort of thing. And uh, I reckon I probably might do some grinding, actually, in between videos for next time, just to see if I can, like I say, maybe synth Batman and, and uh, Arc Dark King Slime together. Don't know if that's really going to be beneficial, but... Uh... Okay, here we go. Do you want to enter? Or do. Category C. Thousand gold. All right. Now let's let's hear a, a true uh, master of uh, commentary. Sh let's see how it's done. Master of ceremonies, you best be listening wherever wherever you are. It's time for the Monoceum's Category C tournament to begin. And now to introduce our competitors. First up, we have the talented, the triumphant, the taciturn, cryptic. The taciturn. I actually didn't know that's how you said that word. His opponent hails from hell's most horrifying hollows, but he still pays heed to your happiness. It's the well being. <laughs> the well being. <laughs> oh, I fucking love Dragon Quest. That's a big Hello, red bird. Alright. How's this gonna go? So we've got uh, a blood, a bloody hand, foul beast, roistering rooster, and dancing flame. So technically, I don't think we've... Well, we've seen the dancing flames, but I don't think we've seen these other ones. That booty bounce. 200 damage? Oh my god, yeah, get that Omni heal off. Christ. And Magma Blast, what's this gonna do? Okay, no, that's fine, that's okay. Yeah, it's worrying that we're so slow compared to most monsters we're fighting now. But damn, we're still kicking out good damage. Snappy comeback! Oh, he can counter! Oh, counter on death, right, okay, well he's gone. That's gonna do some good damage. I actually didn't do as much damage to the Dancing Flame as I thought. Okay then. Uh, 
Okay, good, 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 good. Yeah, more, more heal? No, multi heal. Multi heal would be way better. God damn it. That's it. JG, take the hits. Oh. It's, wow, thanks. For, well, Fuego knew that casting fire on that thing would probably not do anything. JG with the sleep again. You beauty. Okay, missed me not really. I mean, okay. But actually, yeah, you, it doesn't really matter if you heal us now. We've already won. We've, got, we've already won. First round down. Our first winner today is the Cryptic Kid! He's reliable, undeniable, with a pedigree that's verifiable. Give it up See, for the Cryptic that's just, Kid! That's just, just pure fire, honestly. Oh, see, you're just, you're just a legend. His next opponent is a mad machine made to mutilate, break, eliminate, and then exterminate. Killatron! Killatron. K1LL4tron. Or was it TR0N? Ooh. It's time for our second match. On your marks, get set, kill. I think he's got, uh, he's got a Metal Dragon. He's also got, was it a Cyber Slime? Yeah, he totally does. He totally does. If I get one of those, I'm gonna have to call it Arnie. I really am. Right, hard-boiled exoskeleton. <laughs> Face Invader. That sounds horrific. And again, they are attacking first, which is a worry. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> Oh no, don't, 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 don't attack my healer. Don't you do that. Lightning. Yeah, I've not really seen too much of that, have we? Accuracy down on two of them. I'll take that. And Slit JG is getting pretty lucky with those. Right, pretty solid start, I'd say. Yep, smack JG all you want, that is fine. Omni heal. Flame breath, shouldn't do too much. Yep, nothing at all, actually. Oh, okay. Still kicking. Oh, the finisher. Very weak finisher, but still. Uh, go for the missed me again. That's probably not needed at this point, but... Oh, well, there you go. Shows what, it shows what I know. I do like the Metal Dragon design. I really, really can't wait to start finding some metal slimes out in the wild. More more for the XP than actually scouting them, because the chances of me scouting them are probably quite slim. That was a battle to remember. And here's our winner, the Cryptic Kid! You cannot take your eyes off him for a split second. Blink at your peril! His final opponent comes oh, wow. from a savage circus where blood soaks the sawdust in side-splitting hilarity. I give you giggles. Giggles. You're fucking terrifying, mate. And whoa. Okay, he's got a hypothermian. Who will reign victorious? What was that thing next to it? The deciding matchup. On your marks, get set. What was that big? It almost looked like he was wearing a toga. He's got a whip. It, it, oh my god, he's, it, he's called a toga! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, I love it! Also, 
Also, Jester Slime, Grim Keeper. Oh, that's fucking great. The Toga. Oh, you are having a bubble bath, mate. Okay, we've just got so unlucky. What are the odds of that actually working? Are you shitting me? Are you actually shitting me? You just one-shot our healer. Okay, well this this suddenly got a little bit harder, didn't it? Oh my god. We really need to kill some of these. Okay, we got one of them. Frick. Ah, and yeah, once we lose our healer, I have no way of bringing them back. That's it. Can we... Okay, thank god it didn't do it again. Alright. We might just pull through this. I was really hoping that would kill one of them. Okay, okay. Three against two. Yes! Dude! Getting so lucky with those sleeps. Oh, you do hit hard. Nah, you're done. You're done, guys. You're done. Nearly. Nearly. It's nearly Toga. It's all Toga now. It's almost Toga now. Almost Toga now. <laughs> we did it! We did it without our healer! Screw you guys! Oh my god. Mr. Pig and Fuego. Absolutely carrying now. Our category C victor is the silent protagonist of the Morlaceum, the Cryptic Kid. A round of applause, please. That was fun. We did it. Both rank C's in the bag. And what's our reward this time? That was a glorious victory. <laughs> This is your prize for winning Category C. Glorious. Uh, a liquid metal slime. Oh yeah, now you're talking. The mausoleum's just better in every way. You are going to try the next category up, aren't you? Uh, maybe I not right can't now. Wait to see it. Yeah, maybe not right now. I think Category B might just be a little bit too much. But who knows? Who knows? Um. Right, well that's fantastic. Uh, even though we haven't made any story progress, I feel like uh, I feel like that is still good to get two more categories done. Very, very nice. And I think we are going to end it there, chaps. Thank you very much for watching. I might do some leveling off screen. I think uh, especially getting some of these guys leveled and, and maybe synthing a couple of them. If I do, I'll obviously update you on what I did. Uh, and next time we'll explore the middle echelon of the circle of indulgence thank you so much for watching please i hate asking but if you do if you do enjoy these uh give them a like and uh yeah let me know again what, what you feel of the way that this is handling the uh the story because i'm very curious very curious take care everyone bye bye for now